Hey yo, what is up you guys? This is Tyler or Explosify here and I am back with another video today. Be sure to submit your clips for my top five plays. I will have to edit it early because I'm going on vacation this weekend. So please send them in as soon as possible and uh, I will most likely see them and be able to put them in. But today's topic is kind of interesting or strange or scary depending on how you look at it, I guess. So today is currently Thursday the 23rd and I had fire training last week and I got back last Friday, right? Well, fire training was fine and all. It was like 95 degrees though with all that fire gear on. It feels like 110. I was sweating balls, I'm telling you. However, even though I sweated balls, it was still pretty fun. I officially got my red card through the Army National Guard which pretty much just allows me to be called in um, to go fight fires if, you know, they need me. But no, yeah, it, it was actually pretty fun. They taught us, you know, how to fight fires and the smartest ways to do it without getting hurt, things like that. Obviously, you know, nobody wants to get hurt doing that stuff. They, they taught us all the right things and it was pretty fun. I went with about seven other guys from my Army National Guard unit. All the rest just didn't really want to do it, which, you know, that's whatever. Ooh, okay, I got lucky there. That, that I should not have lived. However, the scary part is coming up here. So the second day we were there, we were only there for five days. Second day we were there, we were told or informed that a soldier had been transported to the hospital because he was suspected of having COVID-19. Now, we didn't really think too much of it at the time because it was, you know, just suspected. It wasn't, you know, for sure. And, you know, I'm a strong believer of innocent until proven guilty type stuff so it's not true until it's absolutely proven to me in my head anyway he went to the hospital took a covid test and found out he was positive for covid19 which sucks for him i i am praying for his family and for him and his friends and everybody that he's around because that's some scary stuff, you know. He had COVID-19 and he was out of our training area within an hour and a half of finding out that he had some symptoms, which is actually really good, you know. You rarely hear that people are out that fast. But they told us that we have a very low possibility of getting it because I'm Army National Guard and the person that had it was an Air National Guardsman in a unit that was decently far away from where my unit is stationed. So I'm not really too nervous that I have it or anything like that. I went and took a test. I'm still waiting for the results to get back. It was an extremely low possibility that we had even any contact with them. You know, I'm not too nervous about it. The only thing I'm nervous about is getting other people sick, obviously, because that would be horrible. So I've been kind of careful. It's just really hard to be careful, you know, when you work all the time and I'm working for the Oregon Army National Guard and we go traveling a lot, so that's hard to do that. But yeah, here's a picture of me and my little team that we were put in. Uh, during fire training. It was actually pretty fun. You know, if you guys play a lot of Call of Duty or whatever, the foul is definitely a good weapon to use. I'm just trying to get it gold right now. You know, just ranking it up as much as I can. Oh yeah, you guys, there's also a brand new social media app that you could download and go follow me on. It's called Parlor. I'll put a screenshot of my account up there. And all you gotta do is search up Parlor and just download it, make an account real quick. It's just like Twitter, but it's just kind of fun to have like something new, just like kind of how TikTok was a new thing. I don't necessarily think this will be as big as TikTok, but I do actually post on there quite a bit. So please go follow that. And while you're at it, you guys can just go follow me on Twitter. I post all kinds of updates on that as well. Ooh, that guy's mad. Oh my goodness. All right, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like if you did. So thank you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.